Hello class, welcome to today's math lesson. Today we are going to be adding two digit numbers and we're going to be doing it by using dimes and pennies. Let's begin. Today we're going to pretend that we are shopping and we are going to be shopping at a fruit shop. Let's go! When we go to a store, we often get a receipt. At the top of the receipt, it will tell us the store's name. And our store's name is the fruit shop. On the receipt, we will have places that tell us what we bought and how much they cost. And then we add all that together to give us the total. The total tells us how much money we need to give in order to buy the things that we want. Today, we're going to be buying some fruit. Yum! I think we should buy an apple. Do you see how much that apple costs? Its price is 20 cents. Well, if we were going to pay the cashier 20 cents, we could give the cashier 10 20 cents. Two dimes makes 20 cents. I think we should also buy an orange. And we're going to write down the price of the orange on our receipt as well. And it is 24 cents. If we were going to pay with dimes and pennies, this is what 24 cents would look like. 10, 20, 21, 22, 23, and 24. Now, for us to find the total, or how much we would need to give the cashier to buy the apple and the orange, we add all of this money together. And I'm going to start with the pennies. We have zero pennies plus four pennies, and zero plus four equals four. And now we're going to add the dimes, and we have two dimes plus two more dimes. Two plus two is four. Four. 44 cents. What if we were going to buy some grapes and a pear at the fruit shop? Well, let's buy some grapes. And we're going to write the amount on the receipt. How much do the grapes cost? That's right, 32 cents. Well, what would that look like in coins? We could use dimes. Count with me. And when we count dimes, we count by 10. 10, 20, 30. Hmm. Now we need two more and we're going to use pennies. 31, 32. That's 32 cents. Now we're going to buy a pair and we're going to write the price for the pair on our receipt. How much does the pair cost? You're right, it's 21 cents. Well, let's count that in dimes and pennies. 10, 20, 21, 21 cents. Well, when we add those together to get our total of how much money we need to give to the cashier, we're gonna start by counting our pennies together. We have two pennies plus one more. Two plus one is three. And now we're going to add our dimes together. We have three dimes plus two dimes, and that equals five or, or 50 cents. So our total is 53 cents. That's how much we need to give to the cashier to buy grapes and a pear. All right, well now we're going to pretend that at our store we want to buy an apple and some strawberries. So let's put the apple on our receipt. How much does the apple cost? That's right, it's 15 cents. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Now let's put the strawberries on our receipt. How much do the strawberries cost? That's right, it's 33 cents. Well, let's count that in dimes and pennies. 10, 20, 30, 31, 32, 33. 33 cents. 
Well, when we add these together to find the total, we're going to start with our pennies. We have five plus three. Hmm, how many cents would that be all together? You're right, it's eight. And now we're going to add our dimes together. We have one dime and three more dimes. That would equal four dimes. And we're putting the four in the tens place, which means 40 cents. All together, we need to give the cashier 48 cents. Thank you so much for playing store with me today. Today we reviewed adding two digit numbers using dimes and pennies. And I'm so glad that you played with me today. I hope that you get a chance to play store today. You can set up your own little store and write your own receipts. I hope that you have someone that you can play with. Have a wonderful day class. Bye-bye.